so I've been getting a lot of signals today and Spirit's been like talking to me through numbers and I came across this article because I always look up the numbers in Hebrew okay instead of just like the spiritual meaning because the spiritual meaning is cool but it's always like rainbows butterflies and bullshit I feel like and I'm just like yeah that's cool but that's not real life like real life is darkness too you know so I looked them up in Hebrew and sometimes it's like scary a little bit I don't know the words are scary but anyways so I read this article about 2019 and Eve being able to come up on the most high throne and see like the snakes in the grass or whatever anyways this article said about how the Hebrew language was symbols and how not like our language and blah 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 and I'm like that's such bullshit because numbers are a way to communicate spirit literally contacts me through these numbers I, I don't know if it's because I'm Virgo and because I need like tangible shit like but when she she came to me it was like all in my head like ooh, like a channeling but now I communicate through these numbers with her or her him or whatever whatever anyways um so it's like if you look at all the alphabets no matter what fucking alphabet you're looking at you can see the similarities in it like numbers are literally explained through um how they're drawn out like they're literally little pictures so like the feminine energy moves and swirls and circular emotions because the feminine energy is fast moving like so it's like a woman will go when she gets in a relationship she'll she'll be the bitch who decorates and does all the like fun swirly blah 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 shit and the man is takes care because the, the masculine energy is slower it's hard straight lines but it moves so much slower i don't know how they really use the right it. lane to take exit 84 onto 17th street Sorry, toward 14th GPS. street then but, keep left but the masculine energy is slower but it's very direct whereas a woman's energy is like empty and open like a womb so i guess that's why that brings me to this other point which is like i was reading this book on tantra today by osho who i absolutely love his work and he was saying how you literally have to become like a womb you have to become like empty bamboo like in the middle you have to be you have to be open and like susceptible or like be able to accept or receive this gift from the holy spirit like you can't have prejudgment and bullshit attached to it you don't want to attach any doubt or any fear but you also don't want to attach your own ideals onto things like you don't want to form an opinion about things you want to have morals of course and i guess that's where they draw the line between um i guess the child and like the old crone or like the father it's like do you have wisdom or do you have innocence but it's like being able to being able to decide like when is good to be wise and when is good to be childlike and that's the struggle with people today it's like you have to be one or the other in anything you do everyone says pick a side like are you democrat or republican why can't we be in the middle and that's like i don't know jesus told, told you to like not look from to either side but the whole sephiroi and tree of life is literally you zigzagging up it it's not you taking a straight path it's you taking whatever path you want to take and zigzagging your way up this tree it's like you have to turn left and then you go left a little while and then you go right and then you go left a little while again and it's like balance isn't not going to either side balance is you experiencing things and learning the only way to learn is to have that experience the only way I could ever teach somebody about the Holy Spirit is if if they were willing to learn and wanted to learn and the people who want to learn are the people who the Holy Spirit's already coming to it's like these people are put in your path for a reason and they'll come across the information for a reason because that it's meant for you period everything's a sign and that's why people aren't understanding a lot of the things that I said in my old channel before I deleted it because I guess it wasn't communicating clearly that listen I look at everything in a circle like in a swirl like in spiral time I don't look at things as linear time I look at my life because as something that's already happened because this energy has already existed here and these people 
and these people um have already lived literally my life like it creeps me the fuck out it creeps me out it's it's unreal it's it's I don't even know how to explain it to people unless you've experienced it because it's like I watched a movie and it freaked me out so bad I was hysterically crying and then there's mornings I'll wake up and I'll like I'll, I won't know if this life is real it's like when it's literally like the matrix unfolds for you and once you start seeing the pattern and once you start recognizing it with your own life that's that's the scary part and that's what freaks people out and I feel like that's why people are don't want to know because if I, if I am telling the truth then oh my god like it, that opens up a whole new can of worms and it's not fun to be it's not fun to be on this side like being woke being woke isn't fun being woke isn't fucking exhausting it's fucking miserable you to not have anyone to communicate with and nobody who gets it most of the time around you it's like you have to dumb yourself down 98 percent of the fucking time and then act like you're fucking crazy like oh yeah you're right I was high I'm my bad like you know what I'm saying you have to literally fake how smart you are and fake how how much you know then dumb yourself down and just pretend like and just let people you know yeah yeah you're right I'm sorry I'm, I'm dumb like you literally have to just give people the win and let them think that even if it's not even if they're wrong and they are most of the time and you know that that's their right like let them have that like fuck it you can believe what you want have your own truth man like that but I don't know anyways the only thing like I basically want to convey with this new channel and with my message is just like if you're not operating in love you're fucking wasting your time if you're not operating from a place that's like out of your heart you're wasting your fucking time if you're not going after your dreams and passions and fucking trying to make the world better you're wasting your time like I you period period so that that's all I'm trying to do but stay woke have a beautiful day um yeah if you guys have any ideas for videos please let me know because i just feel like i i know a lot and i just don't know what people want to hear about and if i haven't explained something very well just go ahead and let me know where i'm fucking up so i can fix it so i'm open to anything and if anybody wants to do a video i would love to do a video with somebody to and just like go back and forth talking about this because that's when i feel like most of my knowledge is poured out is like through a conversation not me speaking to a computer screen speaking to a computer screen is fucking hard or like a cell phone like i don't i, I lose track of my thoughts because it's not flowing i guess but anyways love you guys bye